today we're going to remove the battery from this 2013 Dodge Journey. All right, so the battery is located right where the bumper is at. And to access the battery, we actually need to remove the tire. Uh, so I already have my vehicle lifted and secured with jack stands. And we're going to go ahead and loosen this up. We're going to be using a 19 millimeter socket with an impact to make things a lot easier for myself. But it's the 19 millimeter socket to remove the wheel lug nuts. Once we have them all off, just go ahead and remove the wheel and put it in a nice safe location. All right, now we have a lot more access to our cover here. Looks like someone already removed this once and lost a retainer clip. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut that zip tie. And we have this tool trim removal to do these retainer clips or push-in clips, little Christmas tree clips. <laughs> There's a lot of names for these. And wow, those are nice and stuck. So let me go ahead and remove this one from here. Wow. All right, and there it is. This was one of the hardest retainer clips I've ever taken off. So let's go ahead and remove all these from here. We could leave that one to hold it into place. But actually, I'm gonna go ahead and take that off so this whole panel comes out and we have a lot more room. All right, all right, there it is. So the retainer clips are out. I actually had to use two of them. So stubborn. This one for the bet and this one to kind of pinch up and that one to hold it down. Uh, now this whole thing is out. Now we have access to our battery, which is right here. It looks like this is a 13 millimeter. So let's go ahead and grab our 13. This looks like a 10. And we could access the other one, hopefully. Uh, but let's go ahead and remove that bracket for now. All right, I have my speed ratchet swivel to remove this one from here. So I'm gonna go ahead and take that off. All right, and there it is, and that is out. Now let's remove this little bracket from here. All right, there it is, bracket is off. What you could also do, you could move this backwards like this to get a lot more room, a lot more access. And as you can see, that latches right onto that other side, so you have to work this out. There it is. Now let's go ahead and remove our positive and negative terminals. All right, I was actually able to remove this from there. There's the battery bracket. That way we have a lot more access now to remove our battery. Let's go ahead and just move that over to the side. Now we have access to our positive, or this is our ground, or positive. Uh, let's go ahead and remove this one. This one's black, this one's red. Yeah, and you can see our positive mark right there. So yes, let's go ahead and remove our negative one first. It's gonna be a 10 millimeter and a 10 mil here. All right, and I'm just using my ratchet swivel to take that one off. All right, there it is. Let's go ahead and remove that negative terminal. Ugh, that terminal needs to be cleaned. Let's go ahead and remove the positive terminal now. Just break it loose. And let's go ahead and remove our terminal. Just wiggle it back and forth and pull up. All right, and there it is. Just set that to the side. Let's go ahead and remove the battery from the location. All right, and here comes the battery. All right, and there it is. And that is how you remove a battery from a 2013 Dodge Journey. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe.